Hey there, Dominic here. In a previous video I talked about what I thought was a bug in Modo. Uh, what I did was I selected uh, an item, rotated it and then in, uh, edited its pivot and you see this is what happens. Control Z to undo. Uh, I've experienced that before doing this it's best to freeze rotation and freeze scale if you have scaling. And now, when I select the pivot and move it, you see you don't get that weird behavior. So now I can animate this. Uh, for instance, um, so in item mode, when I move it and I have my move tool set to pivot so that it only moves the pivot, now I can press the S key and for on frame 0 I have set a key and for the rotation I'm going to do the same S key for a key on the rotation I'm going to frame 20 and I'm going to rotate it like that and now because the auto key is set to animate it the key has been added automatically I'm going to move the pivot now to the top Go to frame 40, rotate it, and do this, OK. And W moves the pivot because pivot is set on in my tool properties, OK. Frame 60, and again rotate it like that. And on frame 0, I'm going to scale and set the key for the scaling pressing the S key, so now my scale has a key. Frame 20, I'm going to scale it up. And frame 40, I'm going to say scale 1 again. And press the W key again, and when you press F7 now with the position channels selected, I'm going to say stepped instead of curve because my pivot has to be stepped and when I go back to the beginning now and play my animation you see it's rotating around the pivot scaling around the pivot as it should so before doing animation on the pivot it's best to do a freeze of the trans uh, a freeze of the scaling and a freeze of the rotation. So this was Dominic. Hope you found it useful. Bye for now.